Oracle is world's leading database vendor and there is a reason for it. Oracle is very good at listening to its customers and constantly keeps on innovating. Oracle strives to provide world-class database software along with world-class customer support. You can estimate the speed at which Oracle Corporation is moving forward by looking at these top five biggest acquisitions till now. And trust me guys, uh, with the way Oracle is moving forward, I think it has to be the market leader. The first acquisition, I mean, that's not exactly the first one. These are only the biggest acquisitions I'm talking about. The top five biggest acquisitions Oracle had till now. The first one was uh, PeopleSoft, $10.3 billion acquisition in 2005. It's a SaaS platform for human resource, finance, supply chain, and customer relationship management. Siebel Systems, it was acquired for $5.85 billion in 2006. Uh, it's a customer relationship management uh, application. Next was BEA Systems. It was acquired uh, for around $8.5 billion in 2008. Application development and middleware software platform. Next, Micros uh, Systems, it was acquired for 5.3 billion in 2014. It's a uh, retail and hospitality hardware software systems. And the last one, it was NetSuite, and it was acquired for 9.3 billion in 2016. It's again a SaaS platform for uh, enterprise resource planning, ERP. Now guys, the acquisition list of Oracle is pretty big and I could only consolidate the biggest, five biggest acquisitions till now. So these are just the biggest acquisitions till now and there are so many small companies which Oracle has acquired over the years and I believe every year Oracle at least acquires three or four companies. Today, Oracle basically provides a big catalog of products and services but Oracle database still remains the flagship product. Now you might ask me like what exactly is a flagship product? Uh, let's take uh, you have your own shop and in your shop you are selling uh, some products but there is one product which is evergreen like there is no particular season and there is no particular time but that one single product will always sell. So that product you can call it as a flagship product. That means it has high sales irrespective of, of the season and there is no demand and supply kind of curve, it is an evergreen product, you will always have sales for the particular product. Uh, for example, like french fries in McDonald's, it's, it's kind of a flagship product, I think it's a very uh, worst example but still. So kind of like a product that sells more. So the same way with Oracle, Oracle has a lot of products but still Oracle database remains the flagship product it is like hotcake in their catalog now in simple terms a flagship product is the best or the most important thing owned or produced by a particular organization now once again oracle database still remains the best product produced by oracle corporation even after acquiring so many companies so once again this gives one more reason why you should become an Oracle DBA. Now that we know more about Oracle Corporation, its acquisitions and flagship product, let us understand what is a database and what it does. Like I gave this example earlier, Uber is an application to book cab, YouTube is an online website to watch and search free videos. The same way, database is an application which stores massive amount of data like several terabyte size in a structured or unstructured format. It uses structured query language SQL to store and retrie retrieve data from the database. For anyone who is very new to database or understanding database for the first time, let me help you with an example. Think that library is like a database. All the books are stored in cupboards with labels on each rack. These labels help us find books faster and we can call this as a structured storage. Consider the librarian working at the library as SQL. 
you go to library and ask for the book. The librarian knows where the book is kept and gets you the requested book from the rack. The same way, Oracle database stores the data in a structured format that is tables and we use SQL to read or write data into the database. An Oracle database can store data ranging from 4 GB to multi terabyte data size. Awesome. So now you know about Oracle Corporation, its flagship product and what is Oracle database. Now, let us understand what database can do. A database is used to store and handle data such as customer details for a business or medical records, sales data, stock items in one application and many more. So, database content is very easy to manage. Information can be accessed and updated quickly and very efficiently. A database can store and handle vast amounts of data. A user can sort and search a database to find any requested data.